for one of the first to tell you about a pill people swallow that turns into a balloon inside the stomach to lose weight. It's called Obalon, and the company claims you can lose 30 pounds in just three months. We've been tracking one woman's progress, and tonight we show you why she says the thousands of dollars were worth it. I feel great. It's been eight weeks on Obalon for Aura Herrera. This is Aura's before picture from February, and this is Aura now. She's 16 and a half pounds lighter. Here are the side by side comparisons of her standing forward and then when she turns to the side. She said she's noticed a big difference. It's the sheer fact that when you lose weight, you feel lighter and with more energy. Obalon is a pill you swallow that turns into a balloon in your stomach. The balloon is supposed to take up space so you aren't hungry. She started with one balloon, then swallowed another one. Doesn't it feel like there's just a big balloon in your stomach? Doesn't it feel like there's two balloons in your stomach? What do you say to that? No, it's very interesting. Herrera said she feels satisfied, not overly full. She said the biggest key to her success is the app that comes along with Obalon at the it Obesity the Control Center. You put in an option of food that maybe wasn't that great. <laughs> the app will actually prompt you and will give you, which was interesting to me because it'll say, you know, I noticed you ate this, maybe you can eat this. She said the clinic's nutritionist tracks her progress on the app and can message her directly about what she's eating. Which is really convenient, especially if you don't want to keep going back and forth <laughs> across the border. Herrera went to the Obesity Control Center in Tijuana to get it done. Obalon is made in San Diego, but not yet approved by the FDA for use in the United States. And the procedure is not cheap with a $4,000 price tag. Obalon's maker says while all medical devices and drugs have some risks, the balloons are extensively tested. But some experts say patients could damage their intestines and stomach.